Happy holidays, guys. Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Star Flames. And if you're new here, be sure to go ahead, hit that subscribe button, turn on your notification bell, and join the family. Kim Kardashian is getting dragged on Instagram, and she's getting dragged on page six Instagram page. Now, we know that when it comes to doing things, Kim prizes herself to be iconic and she loves to do iconic shit you know that's always what she's saying right and this time around we know kim loves to act as though she's just one of the most brilliant minds in the world when the reality is she's not no we're not saying she's dumb she's slow neither is she stupid because ain't no stupid individual could turn a sex tape into a multi-million dollar empire. And Kim and her conscious mommy, Chris Jenner, or can we say Pimp Jenner, they were able to do that from a sex tape. So we know that she's definitely not slow. Well, sometimes. Can we keep it real? <laughs> sometimes because there are times that she has been hella slow right and we have to call a spade a spade and a shovel hey shovel honey let's keep it real no there's also another thing that we know and that is kim has been copying everything that ye has done all of ye's creativity creativity and each time she gets called up for it she tries to come back and put a little twist on it you know she sits in a corner and she thinks about what would Kanye do that is so crazy and ridiculous that people would hate him and some would love him? That's how Kim thinks. She thinks that she's a 2.0, right? So here she comes with this bright idea, according to her, because evidently the worst of the world, you know, for the most part, are now having it. Besides the little bots that she has on her page and some pages on Insta to make it seem as though... People are supporting it, but for the most part, people ain't. And that's all you know, it's really the Lulu. So, in her head, she came up with this amazing idea of using t-shirt fabrics as gift package. Come on. Like, let's keep it real, right? If you're going to give out some Christmas gifts and you're going to transport those, remember it's white fabric. Now, even though people's hands are clean, you're going to... Use that t-shirt to wrap, you know, packages. How do you get the name? So she's not showing us how the name is on the package, right? She's just showing us some boxes wrapped. And she's talking about skims, gift wrap, you know, t-shirt fabric. When those gets dirty, who's going to clean them? Or is it just a one use? Because if you're thinking along, along the lines of reusable and um, sustainable, right? Because if it's sustainable... It is something basically that you're saying to the world, you can reuse this and, you know, it would be good. Who's going to spend their time to wash all of those white t-shirt fabric? You use them this year, you can't use them to wrap gifts dirty next year. So you're going to have to wash them, right? And how much do they cost? When there are recycled gift papers out here that you could actually use to wrap these gifts. And as such, social media is not having it with Kim and the so-called brilliant idea because ain't no brilliance in using t-shirt fabric, you know, to wrap gifts. How how are you going to put the name if it was red and if it was from a recycled fabric and if she had the story of, you know what, we recycled some plastic bottles, scams work with the solid waste unit and we decided that we were going to make some beautiful fabrics out of these, you know, plastic bottles or paper or, you know, something. And this type of fabric is something that you need a clean piece of cloth to clean. You don't even have to wash it. You can use wipes. You could wipe it off and it comes back really, you know, if she was doing something like that, I could understand the fabric and the sustainability. But no, it's not giving sustainability or anything like that, honey. And as such, the internet is like, 
we're so done with this family. Can you stop talking about this family? We're tired of this family. Like, stop posting about them. Stop talking about them. Like, this is not making any sense because this is not sustainable. And the internet, on page six page, they were dragging the hot mess out of Kimmy Cakes for her Skims t shirt gift wrap <laughs> wrapping because, like, what the heck is that? Right? Even though we have to say that's rich people's business, right? But let's keep it real. No matter how wealthy you are, most times we know that gifts are placed on the floor. Is the floor dirty? No. But when you put a gift, you know, under the Christmas tree, even if it's a man-made Christmas tree, all those little particles are going to be falling on the t-shirt fabric. It's going to be stuck in that fabric. And then it's going to get between your nails and all of that. Who wants that? hot mess to deal it while the gift wrap papers they're so effortless seamless you rip them up you take them throw them in the trash or you can save one of them if you wanted you do it as a memorabilia because you know some folks they do do that they may say okay this is the gift wrap they so they will save like scrap and they put it like in a scrapbook right how are you going to do that with t-shirt fabric you know it's really not making much sense it's not um, sustainable if she had gone about it in another way like in the reuse recycle it's recycled uh, material that made the fabric it's something that I believe more people would gravitate towards but this is really not giving and as such this is why social media is dragging Kimmy Cakes buttocks and guys I want to hear from you because I want to know are you liking this or are you on board with social media, believe that this doesn't make sense and she's just doing way too much? I want to hear from you all. And while you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up, share if you care, and see you all later. Peace.